Hey everybody, I mentioned in a previous video that I have a special way that I like to tie my belt. I'm gonna show that to you. I'm gonna show you two other ways, one being the most basic way you can tie it, the second way being sort of better, and then the third is the best, most awesome, perfect belt tie you could ever do in your entire life. So give it a shot, let me know what you think. Let's check it out. I start with the belt across my midsection at the middle, and I'm gonna wrap it around the back and then cross. And then I'm gonna bring both ends back out in front. One end is gonna go over the other, and that one is gonna go up through the back. I'm gonna cross it back over the other tail and pull through that loop, and now I'm tied. You can see from this angle, the one that goes over the top is gonna to come up through the back behind both layers. It's gonna come across the other tail, through that loop that I just made, and now I'm pulled tight. I'm not a big fan of that technique. It gives me a cross in the back, and the way that it's tied in the front, it's actually pretty easy to get undone. That method is good if you need the belt tied quickly, if you're in the middle of a match, but it's not ideal. What I like to do actually is wrap the belt around myself, and I start with one end of the tail at a spot that it's gonna take you some trial and error. You're gonna have to play around with this a little bit, but once you find your spot, you're gonna know where to go each time. But basically, I'm just gonna wrap the belt around me until I get everything back in front. The tail's gonna come up behind both layers, and then the other tail, I'm just gonna pull that to the front as well. One's gonna go over the top, and it's gonna come up through that loop, and now I'm pulled tight, just like I did the last time. The one that came around is gonna come up through the back behind both layers. I'm gonna come over the top of the other tail, pull through, and now I'm pulling tight again. So you can see that in the back, there's no cross, it's one layer of belt, but it's still the same knot in the front, so it's not super secure. So I'm going to use a bit of a different way to tie it. I'm gonna use my ideal way of wrapping it around. So I'm gonna find my spot again, wrap it around, two times around. Now I'm gonna bring that tail up through the back, just like I did on the last time. I'm gonna bring the other end back to the front, just like I did the last time. But now instead of looping over, the top tail is gonna go between the layers of my belt, but I'm still leaving loop loose so I can tuck this side through. And once it goes through the loop, this tail is also gonna go between both layers. I'm gonna pull that tight. You can see from this angle, I pull up behind both layers, and I'm gonna come across in between both layers. But I'm not pulling all the way through, I'm still leaving space here in this loop. The other tail is gonna go through that loop, it's also gonna go through both layers. And now I'm pulling tight. Just like last time, I have no cross. It's nice and flat in the back. And now out front, it's a very secure knot. When I wanna untie it, it's actually a bit tough. So it's gonna have a lot more difficulty coming undone while I'm rolling. So play around with it. Try and find your ideal spot and let me know how you like it.